I have no idea what this is. I, we are going to the Enchanted Forest. I said this at dinner. Alright, today is Mother's Day and slash my birthday tomorrow. Hi. So I've been telling them we're going somewhere for like three weeks and they haven't been able to get many answers out of me. We're just going to basically drive there and they're going to see where we're going. That's I've been hating you over it. That's because dad's been lying to us. When we ask him the questions, he just lies about them. <laughs> So we have so, no clue if he's actually telling the truth or not. No, we, we've established that he's telling the truth. We have asked some questions along the way. So what we know for sure is that where we're going is about two and a half hours drive. It's north of Kelowna. It is, I think it's indoor because whenever we're outdoor, Dad slathers himself and everybody else with sunscreen. So we think it's indoors. It's a place that is not open all year round, but it's not a, a single isolated event either. So it's some kind of place that's open seasonally, we think. We had to leave by 8 o'clock in the morning, which we're 15 minutes behind already. So 17. We think it's open at about 10 o'clock in the morning. We're not sure if you can get food there. He doesn't seem to be sure either. And apparently it's a combination of more than one thing to look at at a time. And apparently so we're Dad lost. That That's we all buy. we know. We don't know anything else. Guesses have varied from amusement <coughs> park to renaissance fair. <laughs> well, there was a place where we could have gone and uh, thrown axes at targets today in Revelstoke. But apparently we're not doing that either. Oh I would gosh. love to do that. I know, that would be awesome. Wouldn't be safe for me. All right, so awesome. are you guys ready to go? Yes! yes, let's go. And we get to keep asking questions along the way. Um, the only rule is he's not allowed to lie and say he doesn't know the answer to something he knows the answer to. He's allowed to say, I'm not saying, well, doesn't but he mean, can't lie. Doesn't that mean that he does know? It's just. Well, no, he, well, he can just say, I won't say. Well, I'm not telling. Won't it basically just mean yes? Because normally. Say <laughs> yeah, no, normally right? I would say, I don't know. <laughs> See, they're just trying to trick me. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we're gonna see in like two and a half hours. Yeah. And it's like super nice out today. It's like twenty, gonna be twenty-five degrees. No, so. twenty-seven. Twenty-seven, according to weatherman Kale. No, according to Google. Okay, D, what do we know for sure? So, we know that it's going to be something we all enjoy, which means it's not going to have to do with heights or water. Um, it's going to not have any exercise related to it, so that's good. Does it have anything to do with animals? I'm not sure. I have young knows, that's why I took a photo okay. so long. So it's not a zoo? Does it have any historical significance? Uh, yes, kind of. To us, or just to the world in general? Just to the world. Okay, so it's not something that we've ever done. Cool. I'm kind of thinking that it's now like a zip line. Because I think all of us would enjoy that, like an indoor zip line. Um, you're forgetting it, Captain Fira Heights here. <laughs> Is it nature related? Kind of. Okay. Part of it. Okay. Okay, so I just asked an interesting question, but I'm not sure how to interpret the answer. I asked Dad if it has anything, if there will be dinosaurs there, and he said, kind of, which to me is the equivalent of, are you pregnant? Kind of. I mean, there either are dinosaurs or there are not dinosaurs. <laughs> so I did see this one kind of theme park thing that you can go to where they have like 80 life-size dinosaur-ish things. That would be very so, cool. So I don't know. Okay, there's going to be three places, three places we're going to. <laughs> But you flipped up a fourth finger there temporarily. <laughs> I couldn't tell I had four. <laughs> okay. Dad doesn't know he has Wait, five we're fingers. Going to three places? Yeah. And one of them is the dinosaur place. Dinosaur! Yeah, it's not called a dinosaur place, but. Well, what's it called then? You might as well tell us now. If there's kind of dinosaurs there, it's a dinosaur place. Uh, 
Log barn. Log barn. Okay, so where do we have to guess the other places? First stop, log barn. This is gonna be exciting. What? Just got here with a whole bunch oh, of fake see? animals. Yeah, animals, whatever you say. The world's largest goat walk. <laughs> this place is probably what? kind of stupid. <laughs> <laughs> like these people here Where are the either. Where the hell have you taken us? Most tackiest landscaping. Like, this looks like Novak from Fallout in Vegas, a place known for like its tacky This is scary. Look at it, I told you, dinosaurs. But they're not real dinosaurs. See that nobody else knows what Novak is, Dylan. Yeah. This is what this is what I told you. You asked if there were dinosaurs. I said, well, kind of. And animals, and you said, well, kind of. I didn't walk up to that bear and yelled at them. And I fat. suppose you can count those horses. So we basically guessed every right answer about the same place. Yeah, good job. Let's go see the goat sister over this way. Oh, look at it. There's a goat yes, it's on the thing. That's what I said. It's the world's largest goat walking. Oh, they can, like, walk all the way across goat. here. Goats are scaring me. All right, goat. Go, goat. Go, goat. I want to see you walk. The goat walk. Well, it's actually kind of more of the goat pose. Maybe if you run up there with it, Kale. Oh, that goat's mad. Oh, he's walking the goat walk, Kale. Oh, he's scary. He was. It's like he just decides, I'm gonna take five steps. Come on, goat walk! Oh, there he goes. Oh, oh, no, no. What do you like, Dylan? I liked all the antique stuff, and I almost bought a scrap metal motorcycle for 15 bucks. And an right awesome here? wooden lighthouse yeah. for me. Oh. I love that wooden lighthouse. Don't have to drive me away otherwise. All right, on to the next one. All right, stop number two is coming up. Hopefully. I have no idea what this is. I we are going to the Enchanted Forest! I said this at dinner! Up there is your tire. You can't go that way. Back I go. Okay, well apparently I missed something over here. A couple, um, the lady used to make cement figurines without molds or anything, and her and her husband bought this place and he built the candy cane house that they lived in. Oh yeah? Yeah. And so they placed her figurines all over and then when the traffic part patterns changed here and tons of cars started driving by, they started stopping to ask if they could look at it. Oh, so wow. in 1960, a decade later, they opened it to the public. Yeah, you thought that was a real person I in there. Tell. Why would he just no, because you looked at him like you were thought he was gonna give you trouble for climbing on the horse. Hi, creepy guy. It's a bunny. Hi, hey, bunny. It's not a bunny. Yes, it is. No. The three little pig houses. I didn't even know you knew this story, Kale. Oh, look at this is the straw house, wood house, and brick house. Okay. And and what's this running running technique from? Not a toe. 
Naruto. This is by definitely the coolest treehouse ever. Humongous thing. I can actually stand upright in here. Shoda? <laughs> this is making me terrified. No camera breaking. <laughs> like actually lean forward, D. Yeah, no, 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 no. Is, is Goldilocks and the three bears in there? No, no they're all dead. <laughs> <laughs> So I would say the Enchanted Forest is definitely worth a stop while you're driving down 97 Highway. there oh Fun? Yes. Yes, we did. Yeah. yeah. There was a lot to see here. I just had to run across basically a field because I decided to take pictures of old cars. Like this really is the size of a town. Yeah. <laughs> to walk through end to end. It's nice. I'm tired. What did you like the best, Kim? I think I, I like Mom's reaction to opening that coffin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was pretty funny. That was pretty funny. Okay, I, sit back. I think we got to go out there. No. No, it says exit. No, I've seen people go out that way. <laughs> <laughs> 